Welcome back, fight fans. Welcome back. Welcome back. Let's just dig right into it. You know, I'd like to start off first by introducing the Boxing Guru Show. You know, that's one of our affiliates. Uh, they're going to be bringing us an in-depth look at, you know, different boxing topics in the UK. Please check them out. Their link is in the description. And go subscribe to their channel. Show them some love. But let's just dig right into it. Dillian, the body snatcher right, has really made some interesting statement in regards to Oslander Usyk and basically stating, according to Boxing boxingnews.com that Usyk will not do well at heavyweight at all. Now, what I don't understand is how Oslander Usyk won't do well at all at heavyweight when you have a lot of guys like Big Baby Miller who are using performance enhancing drugs and you know he's fighting a bunch of bums and you know even with his work rate and even on the drugs he still didn't look spectacular his defense was poor and so when you introduce a guy at the level of Usyk who who's already been undisputed at cruiserweight a guy who has elite level you know foot movement hand skills uh, you know who who has a lot of boxing ability who took Tony Bellew and dragged him into deep waters and stopped him you know Usyk is a very, very talented and very technically savvy, high IQ type of fighter. And I do believe those skills will translate to the heavyweight division. The question with Oslander Usyk is not about his skill set. It's about his power and his durability. Can he take enough big shots and can he be defensively responsibly enough to be able to, to survive taking shots because we all know that Usyk does take shots and he has taken punishment from other fighters but I do believe that Usyk has a skill set that can translate into the heavyweight division and I think that he would give Dillian White an extremely challenging fight at this point I would still rank Dillian White over Oslander Usyk I would favor him to beat Usyk but I think Usyk you know has to show us and prove to us that he can compete at the heavyweight division and I think that's exactly what he'll do I think he'll go out and put on an impressive performance and I think he'll show the world how greatly talented he is, how, you know, how his skills can translate from one weight class to another. Because, you know, truly special fighters, their skills can translate. Usyk's not a small guy um, and he's about 6'3". And so his skills and his size is big enough to be a heavyweight. You just have to realize that heavyweights today are just ginormous. Looking at Anthony Joshua, Tyson Fury, Deontay Wilder. And the fact that Deontay Wilder's on the smaller side, shorter side, and he's still able to compete shows me a lot. Because, you know, if you look at Usyk, his skills skills definitely make up for some of his size and power deficiencies in the heavyweight division but he still has pop and his skills can tire out opponents look at Tyson Fury you don't have to be a knockout artist in the heavyweight division to be able to win and be impressive but once again unbiased as always just IBFP please share like and you must absolutely subscribe